here. I think he heard him. I heard him. He's, he's low enough. He's I, think, I think we can go back down where we were last night. Get set up right there. Get set up right in the same spot. Yeah, you'll probably come down that valley. Okay. Okay, you guys go down right in here. Set up same place. I'm gonna go back down to that pond that's just underneath it, and I'm gonna do a little bit of solution. We'll get him to come Try to pull him back. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Giving us a thumbs up. Woo! Oh, oh, Glenn, that is a stud of a moose, buddy. <laughs> that is awesome. Look at him. He is a giant. Look at how big a body. I thought Shiris didn't get as big, but look at the size of him. Hold that bow up. Oh, oh, look at him. He is gorgeous. He's got awesome points, doesn't he? Long tines on him. Thank you, buddy. Oh. And what a shot. Oh, Thank man. you. Perfect. Yeah, he only went, what, Not 75 yards? That muzzy trail car put it on him. When they come in like that, too, I mean, if that don't get your blood pumping, nothing does. I mean, he just, oh. And I seen him coming, I'm like, I had a hard time keeping it all together, but. That's my first moose with a bow ever. He's got some cool looking points. Long, and his brows are strong. This is a good shiris right here. Look at this palms. You guys wanna hunt big shiris moose? Give Glenn a call at Blue Brana. Gotta thank you and Donna both. You've been awesome to us over the years. I mean, we've shot in giant mule deer, and now we just anchored a giant shiris moose. Yeah, baby. Time to get the outdoor edge out and uh, put the wild pack to use. We got a lot of knives for you boys. Try touching it up. Pretty fortunate to see this kind of country and experience this. That's what it's all about what being a bow hunter is about. It isn't always really about getting them, but it's just extra special when it all comes together.